Trevor, we know that personal branding is very important. As mentioned before, job seekers should come out of from their resume and cover letter and they should be their personality should shine out. They should show who they are, their authentic self. In that sense, how can job seekers do that? And if they are not comfortable in front of the camera or if they're not comfortable, you know, kind of selling yourself while you're doing job interview, what tips you have for those people? Oh, that's the first thing that you said. If they're not comfortable, they better get comfortable. Uh, get yourself out of your comfort zone. Your comfort zone is killing you, okay? Mm -hmm. Growth happens outside of your comfort zone. And, and I want you to think about it right now. If you were going to hire somebody, do you want to hire somebody who's in the growth zone, who's, who's really tackling on things and really doing outside the box things and, aren't, and isn't scared and is innovative and creative? Or do you want somebody who's nice and warm and cozy in their comfort zone who's afraid to make any changes. Like, who would you hire, right? That's number one. So you said something, first and foremost, get the heck out of your comfort zone, right? The job search is uncomfortable as it is. Mm -hmm. So we gotta get comfortable on camera. When it comes to branding, you need to brand yourself. You need to get in front of the camera. You need to be posting content. You need to be doing it on a regular basis on social media. Your LinkedIn profile needs to have a banner with a really nice professional photo on there. And you need to do some, some clever things that really help people to identify who you are. Like I'll give you some, some silly examples, but job seekers can take this in their own direction. Um, there are some people out there that are well known for what they wear and what they dress in. Yeah. Um, so uh, let's see, I'll give you an example. Different props, I know this sounds silly guys, but different props, like I use this little whiteboard, okay, all the time. You'll see this in a lot of my videos, you'll see a lot of things where I'm holding this up. So this becomes my branding, right? This becomes my branding. Um, we also do little things on the show, uh, mic drop moments where I'll, I'll drop the mic. So you yeah. see me do that all the time, I drop the mic. So yeah. that's a branding thing. People reach out to me and they're like, oh, here comes a mic drop moment. They know that about me. Okay. For job seekers, it doesn't have to be that. It could be something different. It could be um, the glasses you wear. It could be the hat that you wear in your picture. It could be many different things, but have a consistent branding that you do in your videos, in your content, in your copy, when you're writing the, the, the black and white text in your copy, maybe it's a certain phrase that you use, okay. but you, you have to keep it consistent so people recognize you when they see it. Yeah. Those are great tips, uh, Trevor, I appreciate that. And I, I'm hoping that my audience, whoever searching for a job, will use that in their new job search. And again, for the audience watching or listening, if you have any other tips in terms of personal branding, Please leave it in comment section and tune in next time for another great question with Trevor.